In the previous lesson we had learned about basic concepts in three phase systems and we saw that a three phase system consumes lesser amount of conductor okay you can essentially deliver a three phase power by just three wires okay so in this lesson we are going to analyze what are the different connections through which we can connect a three phase source and a three phase load okay three phase source is essentially my set of coils which are generating my three phase power okay and three phase load is essentially the load or the device which i am driving through this three phase power okay so first we are going to analyze a star connection or a star system okay you basically have two types of systems you have a star system and you have a delta system okay in a star system what happens is we connect the coil such that one end of the coil is tied together okay let's just say this is my coil a a dash okay now this end is also connected to the other two coils okay so this is my let's say b b dash okay and through this end i also connect my other coil which is c c dash okay so this type of a connection is known as a star connection okay your power is delivered through your transmission lines okay you just draw out wires from these ends and these become your transmission lines okay so your power is supplied through these lines which are called as your transmission lines in a delta connection what happens is all the coils are connected in a closed loop okay so this is essentially a delta connection okay you have your a dash a which is like this you have your b dash b which is like this and you have your c dash c which is like this okay the three coils are connected in a closed loop and you connect your transmission lines like this okay your power is delivered through transmission lines which are shown like this this is your delta connection okay this is essentially a delta source okay your load is connected between transmission lines okay so your load is connected between transmission lines like this essentially we are going to be looking at a three phase load okay so my load would be having three set of impedances which would be connected across three set of pairs of lines like if this is line 1 this is line 2 this is line 3 then one impedance would be connected across 1 and 2 another impedance would be connected across 2 and 3 and another impedance would be connected across 1 and 3 okay like this now let's look at certain terminologies that we use in a three phase system first we are going to understand what is a balanced load system okay when we say we have a balanced load then we basically mean that the impedances that are connected across my lines they are all equal okay so if let's just say this is my z1 this is my z2 and this is my z3 if z1 is equal to z2 which is equal to z3 which is equal to some impedance given by r plus j x l then i say i have a balanced load okay so whenever all the set of impedances are equal you have a balanced load and if they are not equal then you have a unbalanced load okay next we are going to look at what is your line voltage line voltage also known as your line to line voltage okay sometimes it is written as line to line voltage or 